Thank you for tuning in to another episode of Classified Captures. Today's episode will take you on a journey that will defy the ordinary and leave you breathless with anticipation. Prepare thyself as we dive into the realm of the enigmatic. For our first trail cam image of the day, we're confronted with a puzzling scene. In this capture, we have an unidentified creature seemingly determined to break through a wired fence. It has brown fur, teeth sharp enough to cut through the wires, and an appearance that suggests it's nothing but a wild feral creature. Beyond that, its limbs are also slightly unnatural. It's almost as if it were a creature capable of standing on its hind legs, yet is bent over trying to get through the fence. The purpose of erecting a fence is typically to ward off unwanted intruders, but this creature appears to pose a significant challenge to that security measure. With its tenacity and obvious intent, it leaves us wondering whether it actually broke through the fence, and if it didn't, whether its next encounter might result in the fence being torn asunder. So, here's the big question. Is this an unknown species of wild canine, or perhaps something altogether more mysterious? Some in the paranormal community believe we may be looking at a dogman. Taking a second look at the image, I can't fault them for thinking so. But what do you think? Looks like this fella right here has been hiding from something for years now. But what, we may never know. The image was taken by an individual who saw it while out in the woods and decided to share it. Although we may not be able to decipher what sent it up there, we can at least try to find out what creature it was before it ended up as a skeleton. Some users who saw the post had this to share. A user named Donald Deming Coleman Jr. stated that it was a lichen droid. Another named Alex Leedy stated that it had to be a dogman. Quite frankly, I had the same sentiments when I saw it because there are no known creatures with that skeletal makeup. My team and I settled on it being a dogman. That was, at least until we saw this comment that made us rethink everything. A user named Anita Allen stated, Ribs are unnatural in shape, otherwise a young black bear's ribs look like AI as they are not shaped like ribs but something out of a Geiger painting. Great Halloween decoration. He's skeptical about this being real. He assumed we could be dealing with either an AI-generated image or a Halloween decoration, and I can see where he's coming from. If we look at his argument, he does have a point. But instead of drawing a conclusion on this one, I thought it'd be best for you to do so. What do you think we're dealing with here? Please leave us an answer in the comments section. This man and his little boy were having a walk outside their property in an isolated part of the woods when all of a sudden he heard a roar coming from the woods. <laughs> the sound was unlike anything that he'd ever heard before. Loud, guttural, and carrying an eerie primal resonance. At first, the father's instincts leaned toward a bear, a known inhabitant of these woods. Yet as the haunting echo reverberated through the trees, he quickly stops recording and grabs his boy. We don't see the creature, and he doesn't either, leaving him and us, of course, with questions. Could this be a bear, or are we dealing with something enigmatic? Something beyond the realm of ordinary wildlife? Could it possibly be the legendary creature of the woods? Bigfoot. Some members of the Classified Captures team think so. What about you? Speaking of Bigfoot, there's another intriguing trail cam capture that has set the internet abuzz. In this mysterious image, we're greeted by an enigmatic figure that's shrouded in haze, standing tall in the distance. This enigmatic creature appears to be standing upright on two legs, and from what we can discern, its head and shoulders are noticeably covered in fur, lending to the classic description of a Bigfoot. However, as we take a closer look, something seems rather peculiar. While Bigfoot is often portrayed as a massive and robust creature, this particular specimen appears somewhat leaner and slender in comparison to the traditional depictions we're familiar with. It leaves us wondering if this could be a different species entirely, a juvenile Bigfoot, or perhaps even an entirely unrelated mystery lurking in the depths of the forest.
In this capture, the homeowner captured a pair of eerie red glowing eyes in his backyard. The eyes appeared to be fixed in one spot and didn't blink. Understandably, this was quite unnerving for the homeowner who decided to share the footage online. The internet community was quick to offer their theories. Some suggested it might be the legendary Chupacabra known for its blood-sucking tendencies. Others brought up the Rake, a creature from urban legends, and even the Mothman, another mysterious entity with red eyes. However, some took a more practical approach, proposing that it could be a mountain lion or some type of reptile. Given the location, these explanations seem less plausible, but anyone who's heard the legend of the Mothman or seen images knows that we're definitely dealing with the Mothman. Here's the thing though, no one can say for certain what we're dealing with. Encounters like these often leave us with more questions than answers, contributing to the mystique of the unknown. Regardless of the creature's true identity, it's undeniably a perplexing and eerie experience. Here's another intriguing trail cam discovery that's sure to pique your curiosity. The owner of this trail cam ventured out to check the images captured by his device and was left in awe by what he stumbled upon. In this mysterious image, we're confronted with a large creature, its massive, hairy body partially obscuring the camera lens. Notably, the creature boasts a coat of white fur, a detail that further deepened the mystery. The trail cam owner found himself in a bit of a conundrum trying to make sense of this enigmatic figure. Interestingly, the area where this trail cam is positioned has been the subject of numerous rumors regarding Bigfoot sightings. While the owner hadn't personally witnessed such an encounter, the features of this creature in the photo give him pause for thought. Could it be possible that he had just captured evidence of a Bigfoot's existence on his trail cam? Now it's over to you. What are your thoughts on this cryptic trail cam image? Here is yet another fascinating encounter with what appears to be Bigfoot. Our adventure takes us to the world of TikTok, where a user embarked on a hike and stumbled upon something truly remarkable in the woods. Without hesitation, he took out the camera and started filming. The creature he encountered is definitely a sight to behold, towering in size and enveloped in a shroud of dark fur. What's even more intriguing is that it seemed to be walking upright on two legs, the hallmark characteristic of Bigfoot. And as if aware of the camera's presence, this mysterious being seemed to acknowledge the TikTok user's gaze. Bigfoot sightings like this one continue to baffle and mystify, leaving us with more questions than answers. In this particular encounter, the creature's behavior adds to the enigma. Our next intriguing piece of footage comes to us from Shawnee, Oklahoma. In the still of the night, a trail cam captured an unusual sight, a lone woman wandering in the darkness. The woman is dressed in what appears to be a flowing dress, her hair neatly gathered up in a bun, her back turned to the camera. This mysterious nocturnal presence raises numerous questions. What could have led her to venture outside at such a late hour? Is she a homeless individual seeking shelter, a sleepwalker lost in her own dreams, or perhaps something more mystical, like a modern-day witch engaged in a secretive ritual? Well, it's not exactly easy to say, but tell us what you think. Our next clip leaves us with an unusual sight to ponder on. At first glance, you notice a deer standing right in front of the camera, its presence captured by the lens. However, what makes this image truly enigmatic is what lurks in the background just above the bushes. There, a peculiar orb of light hovers in the distance, seemingly suspended above the deer's head. Its source and purpose remain shrouded in mystery. What could possibly explain the presence of this ethereal glowing enemy in the woods? Could it be a natural phenomenon, a trick of the light, or something otherworldly? 
My team and I lean towards the supernatural because orbs typically represent that, but then again, we have no iota of evidence. This leaves us with more questions than answers as we contemplate the strange interplay between the deer and the mysterious orb. What do you think of the whole thing? In this airy footage sent in by a subscriber, Jen Graff, we find ourselves amidst a foggy night where an unexpected encounter unfolds. He recorded this footage in his son's driveway. Pay attention to the footage. Did you catch it? A pale, enigmatic creature makes a brief appearance passing in front of the camera lens. What's truly perplexing is that Jen didn't notice any presence around them at the time. It was as if this mysterious entity materialized and vanished in the blink of an eye. As we delve into the possibilities, this being doesn't quite fit the bill of a traditional ghost or spirit. With its pallid appearance, one can't help but wonder about the involvement of entities like the infamous Rake or perhaps a shape-shifting skinwalker. But even then, it wouldn't make sense since those creatures can be seen with the naked eye. But Jen didn't notice this creature till he reviewed the footage. What could we be dealing with here? Uh, well, try as we may, we're unable to put our finger on it. The enigma remains unsolved, leaving us to contemplate the nature of this fleeting encounter in the depths of the night. What are your thoughts on this puzzling phenomenon? Jen could really use an answer. Speaking of mysterious captures, if you have footage and clips you'd want us to show on this channel, don't hesitate to send them in. If you're unsure of what you've captured, don't worry. I'm sure the thousands of subscribers who watch the videos could help you make sense of it. Simply send it in to classifiedcaptures at gmail.com. Moving on. In this intriguing footage shared on Reddit, we are presented with an unsuspecting individual navigating the darkness of the night. As he progresses, an eerie and ethereal figure materializes, resembling wisps of smoke coalescing into the form of a human being. This otherworldly entity emerges from the rear of the walking man who remains oblivious to its presence throughout. The sheer fact that this man felt no sensations or disturbances during this encounter adds an extra layer of intrigue to the enigma. What could this phenomena be? Is it a benevolent spirit, perhaps a guardian of some kind, accompanying him on his nocturnal journey? Or does it signify something far more ominous lurking in the shadows, unseen and unfelt? Tell us what you think. In the dense woodlands of Pennsylvania, a group of hunters had strategically placed trail cameras to capture images of the local deer population, a common practice to aid in their hunting endeavors. These trail cams had proven quite effective in the past, however, on this occasion, something rather unusual was captured. Among the towering trees, one of the images revealed a creature that bore a striking resemblance to a Bigfoot, albeit smaller in size. The pictures depicted this enigmatic creature passing through the wooded area. Before you conclude it might be an ape, allow me to add this info. There are no known ape species in the area where this was captured. The presence of such a creature in the vicinity added an element of mystery to the hunter's usual routine, leaving them with more questions than answers about the secrets that might be hidden within the deep woods of Pennsylvania. In a recent video captured earlier this year, we find ourselves in an unknown vicinity, enveloped in the eerie stillness of the dead of night. The camera's lights illuminates the ground, revealing a rather mysterious sight. As we peer into the darkness, we discern the subtle movement of two sources of light moving in unison through the obscurity. Some users who saw the footage stated that it could be a human being adorned with reflective patches on a part of their body. Some also believe it could be an animal, perhaps a fox or wolf going through the woods. 
Members of the paranormal community scoffed at both ideas and believe we're dealing with a paranormal being. What thinkest thou? Share your theories and insights in the comments section below as we unravel the mysteries concealed in the night. In this eerie trail cam footage seemingly captured deep within the woods amidst a blanket of fallen leaves, we're presented with a scene rendered in stark black and white. Of it all lies a pale, lifeless deer, its tiny antlers catching the eye while its wide, vacant gaze remains fixed on the ground. As we peer deeper into the darkness, an intriguing detail emerges. There, in the distance, a brown or orange-hued reflection. This scene raises a series of thoughts and questions. What could have led to the deer's lifeless state? What is happening here? Is the moon's reflection indeed on the surface of the nearby water source? Share your impressions and theories about this enigmatic tableau in the comments below as we piece together the clues hidden within this footage. If you made it this far and haven't hit the like button, subscribed, or even dropped a comment, could you do that before we go on? Thank you very much. It means a lot. Moving back to today's episode. This video clip presents a truly intriguing and captivating scene. An unknown recorder appears to be multitasking simultaneously behind the wheel and capturing an extraordinary moment on the trail cam. The journey unfolds as he continues its path for a while, maintaining the suspense. But then, abruptly, the vehicle comes to a halt and a sharp left turn is made. And there, before our eyes, we witness a black, towering and surprisingly agile creature running swiftly, possibly attempting to evade detection. What was that creature? Well, the verdict is in, and with an unwavering conviction, it is Bigfoot. It's easy to make this verdict because, well, just take a look at the creature. How many wild animals have that physique? And before you mention ape or a chimp, the area this was captured in has none. The experience has undoubtedly left an indelible impression on the rider. What would you have done in his shoes? In this daytime trail cam capture, we're presented with a mysterious figure in motion. It's a puzzling enigma leaving us to wonder whether it could be human, standing at an impressive height of a possible approximation of 6 feet 10 inches. Surrounded by tall groves of green lush trees, the figure appears to have weathered brown skin, possibly from extended time spent in the woods, and sports a peculiar, almost primitive-looking face. Their attire is minimalist, donning nothing but black shorts. The question lingers, what could this entity possibly be? Share your insights in the comments section below. Your thoughts and theories are invaluable in unraveling this enigma. In this intriguing trail cam footage, we may have witnessed something quite extraordinary, a potential UFO sighting. While initially our attention is drawn to the cute raccoon scurrying about, an unexpected event unfolds. Suddenly, a mysterious craft appears in the sky above the unsuspecting raccoon. This craft exhibits an unusual array of vertical lights, a feature not commonly associated with human-made aircraft. The question that naturally arises is whether this sighting offers compelling evidence of an unidentified flying object. No one can say for sure, but members of my team believe we may be dealing with a UFO situation. What say you? In the midst of broad daylight, we find ourselves deep within the woods, surrounded by towering trees with sparse leaves. It's a scene that might initially seem uneventful but a closer look reveals something truly startling. Upon zooming in, we notice subtle movements among the trees, figures that seem almost like a part of the wooded landscape. Their heads tilt in the direction of the camera, and the effect is undeniably eerie. These enigmatic beings are clad in cloth-like coverings reminiscent of masks or veils, lending them an oddly mysterious appearance. 
The question that arises is, what could these creatures possibly be? No one could say with certainty, but there are some who doubted it until one user by the name of at Lauren Elise 8072 made this comment. There's a lot of sightings of different people like this, and it's becoming more and more, and they all look the same peeking around trees. I went camping last summer and was with my boyfriend and dog, and my dog stopped and stared at a specific tree, hairs raised and growled. This humanoid was hiding behind the tree, peeking around at us. Looks exactly like the videos I have seen. It was about 400 feet away from us. This was at Forked Lake in the Adirondacks. Then we felt watched at our campsite, which after a few hours and hearing twigs snap behind me as I was leaving the outhouse and follow me was a huge nub for me and we packed up and left. It was our last night there. The night prior to that, something touched the tent between mine and my boyfriend's heads which made the tent cave in where it was being touched and we chalked it up to being an animal. No sounds, only silence and my dog was losing her mind barking. No tracks whatsoever the next morning. Creepy. What do you think of these captures? Any thoughts or experiences to share? Please do so in the comment section. In the remote and rugged mountains of Russia, a solitary hiker was immersed in the beauty of nature when his journey took an unexpected turn. Intriguing and eerie noises emanating from a cave-like structure beckoned him towards his enigmatic depths. Fueled by curiosity, he illuminated the cavern's mouth with a beam of light, revealing a shadowy figure within. The creature that met his gaze was an enigma shrouded in darkness, its form obscured by the dimness of the cave. Its fur dark and inscrutable hinted at an awareness of the hiker's presence. Such encounters with unknown beings or creatures in remote and desolate places have been the subject of folklore and legend for generations. In this instance, we're left to ponder the species of this cryptic entity. Have any answers? Please do share in the comment section. Yes, the footage you are seeing is no movie set or scene. It's an actual place somewhere in Cannock Chase. How the dolls got there, no one knows exactly. According to reports, the dolls showed up one day displayed in an eerie fashion. Some time later, a Ouija board was spotted in the same place with no explanation. Naturally, all who saw it were scared and the news spread of the unnatural dolls spreading like wildfire. It was even uploaded online, which led to many speculations. Some believed the woodland area had been cursed, others believe a cult was responsible, and many others thought the place had been used for a ritual. After a year, no one went near the dolls for fear of dropping dead or worse. The room was escalated and became so unbearable that a police officer got rid of all the dolls and Ouija board one day. That was the last anyone heard of them. But we can't help but wonder, did the police meddle with the supernatural? And is he fine? I guess we may never know. Photobombing is typically associated with human antics, but when another species gets in on the act, it seems that wildlife might just have more fun than we do. It's almost like a scene out of the penguins of Madagascar, offering a glimpse into the world beyond human understanding. Take a look. This snapshot was taken, uploaded, and shared on a scorching afternoon. Amid the expanse of a sprawling plantation, two lovers are clearly reveling in the moment. Perhaps they were on a land-hunting adventure, exploring a few acres of the plantation. Little did they realize their joyful moment was about to be unexpectedly interrupted by an intruder lurking in the trees. A brown-hued creature perched in the trees emanating an air of unwavering confidence with its effortlessly executed pose. Currently, the identity of this photobomber remains a mystery, though its distinctive brown appearance is evident. Could it be a small creature like a squirrel moving in the background? Is it a much larger creature like a bear or possibly a cryptid? Well, the online community is divided about this. What do you think? Next, we have this very unusual trail cam capture of deer. Wondering what makes this capture unusual? Take a good look at the deer in the image. 
Do you see those claw marks? They look like they were inflicted by something really big and dangerous. But what could have done that? The truth is, no one knows, not even the one who uploaded the image online. He believes it could be a cougar or a bear, but I haven't known these creatures to let their prey go, especially once they'd captured it, unless by some stroke of luck. So tell us, what do you think happened to this deer? Would love to know your thoughts. We've been asking you to send in your footage, and one subscriber sent in these odd and enigmatic captures, and they are just the way we like them. Have a look. These captures were taken in the woodlands some time ago. They're oddly intriguing us, making it challenging to determine their nature. In the captures, we see some kind of dark-furred creature moving through the leaves. While the features are different to discern, it's clear that the creature in the footage bears no resemblance to humans or any known wildlife. From the capture, we can tell that whatever it is, assuming it's not a large shadow or simply a function of the camera, is huge. This leads us to consider the intriguing possibility that we might be dealing with a cryptid. And which cryptid fits the bill? Well, you guessed it. Bigfoot. Could this enigmatic figure be Bigfoot? Share your thoughts with us in the comments section. Now let's step into the paranormal and mysterious. Take a look at this trail cam capture. Do you see the creature in the capture? It looks like some type of ape, doesn't it? But take a closer look. You'll realize its body proportions are definitely not the same as any known ape. What's more, there's something funny going on with its face. Despite the blurry nature of the footage, the uploader believes the creature is holding a baby close to its face. My team and I struggle to see that, but can you? If you can, please do share in the comments section. As remarkable as that is, that's not what makes this capture special. The image was taken in Florida, and the uploader believes it's a capture of none other than the skunk ape. For those unfamiliar with the skunk ape, think of it as a version of Bigfoot that lives in the swamps. With that said, what do you think? Could this really be a skunk ape, or is this whole thing merely an exaggeration? Share your thoughts with us. Aliens are all the buzz now, and we can understand why, but this is footage from some years ago, and we can't even emphasize enough how eerie looking it is. Take a look. So, what do you see in the footage? Did you initially think it was an alien or an extraterrestrial being? If so, I wouldn't blame you. Interestingly, some individuals have been sharing snapshots of this creature on paranormal pages, claiming it to be an alien. But what if I told you that this isn't an alien at all? What if I said that what you're seeing is actually a bear? Would you be surprised? The creatures you're witnessing in the footage are actually bears that supposedly reside in a sanctuary in Germany. Strangely, they began losing their fur at a certain point without any apparent reason. In fact, even the zookeepers couldn't pinpoint the exact cause. Either way, you have to admit that bears look pretty different when they don't have their coating and fur. Although the circumstances are unfortunate, it's interesting to see. Wouldn't you say? Still on the subject of Bigfoot, you might want to see this next footage taken that might just be the most controversial Bigfoot post we have ever made. In the first few seconds of the footage, we see a struggle between whoever is recording and a larger creature. The creature appears ape-like. According to the explorer whose video it is, that was a scuffle between himself and Bigfoot. Sounds wild, right? And there's more to the story. This intrepid explorer claims to have successfully killed the creature. He even provides pictures and, more astonishingly, the corpse's evidence. Let's take a look. Yep, that's Bigfoot, according to the explorer. He actually believes and states he killed Bigfoot. If you're struggling to see the Bigfoot in the footage, it might be due to his actions. But let's pause for a moment. What are your thoughts? Could he have indeed met the creature, or is this a made-up story to get famous? Share your thoughts and feelings in the comments section. I have had chills, but never have I had chills down my spine like this before. And guess the culprit. 
The next footage I'm about to show you, the footage was taken by residents of Oregon way back in 2013. From the dead... From the depths of the woods, a chorus of hysterical laughter echoes through the night, sending shivers down spines and chills through souls. The very air seems to vibrate with the eerie sound, a melody that's both haunting and otherworldly. No one knows what or who was making the sounds, but one dared venture into the woods to find out. Some speculate it could be a hyena, a creature known for its distinctive cackles, but with every passing moment, doubt creeps in. The sheer loudness and persistent nature of the laughter seems to defy any logical explanation. Whatever this entity is, it's not your typical forest dweller. Photobombing. Before I say anything about this particular one, watch the footage. Two, three, four. I don't see the thumb. There's a, there is a print right here that shouldn't be there. Yeah. And I'm going to tell you what this thing did. You can pick it up barely right that's now. A, that's a left-hand print. That's the kitchen. So yeah. the interesting part about yeah. these windows, these were the only two windows in the entire home that you could see through the curtain. We changed they, those. She changed those curtains yesterday. They, this thing was peeking in to see what y'all were doing. That's the only, that's the only there, window he could see. Was, it was peeking in to see what she were doing. Yup, you heard what you heard. The man in the bluish shirt lives in the home you just saw. According to him, their time in the house was interrupted by a giant furry creature that appears to be looking into their home. The man in red came over to carry out some friendly neighborhood forensics and concluded that they indeed had been visited by a Bigfoot. He points to handprints on the window, which we can't see, but just imagine being in your home and seeing a giant ape-like creature staring into your room. I can't imagine what it would feel like. Some people in the comments section are convinced that the Bigfoot was only curious, while some thought it was only there because it was hungry and could smell something nice from the kitchen. Others, however, don't share that enthusiasm. They think he was there to plan his attack. It's hard for us to believe a Bigfoot would do that, though. It's out of its character. But what do you think about the whole thing? Were the men telling the truth or simply looking for fame? Share your thoughts with us. As a hiker ventured along his well-trodden path, a desire to capture its enchanting allure urged him to wield his camera, immortalizing each fleeting moment. Let's take a look at what he captures. Entering a remote stretch of the trail, a small rabbit graces his path. Swiftly zooming in with his camera, he pauses, captivated by the serenity of the scene. Regrettably, this tranquil interlude is abruptly shattered. A growing unease takes hold, gnawing at him without a clear cause. Resolute but puzzled, he chooses to retrace his steps. The further he ventures into the woods, the more unsettling the occurrence has become, prompting his steps to hasten. An eerie symphony envelops him, whispering secrets only the forest knows. Swiftly he turns, only to find that the rabbit, phantom, or reality has vanished without a trace. Amid the disquiet, a faint voice emerges from the depths of the woods, a mere whisper of, Hi there, or perhaps my senses deceive me. Deceive me. Soon, however, the whispers morph into what seems like a woman's voice. The sounds, however. His voice. The sounds, however, are far from comforting. They carry an eerie and distressing tone. Scared, he quickly runs out of the place and posts this online, asking for input and help on what he may have seen. While he and many who viewed the footage believe this quick departure may have saved his own life, a user in the original post proposed an unsettling theory. They suggested the voice sounded like that of a woman who had been gagged, pleading for help. They believe he had the opportunity to save someone who'd been kidnapped or someone who was being trafficked. Watching it on repeat again, I'm tempted to agree with the second person. What do you personally think? This next... <laughs> St 
Still on the paranormal, take a look at this image capture. We know trail cams capture a lot of weird and interesting stuff, but what is that? The individual whose trail camera captured this image is unsure of what it is. Some individuals online told him it might be frost on the camera. I don't know much about that, but this looks like a cobweb of some sort. Some in the paranormal community, however, believe that his camera may have captured something paranormal. The challenge, however, is the fact that we can't tell what it captured. What do you think of his hypothesis, though? Could this merely be frost on the lens, as suggested, or are we dealing with something paranormal here? Have you had such an experience, or can you explain what we're seeing? Please talk to us in the comment section for our curiosity and insatiable search for answers that's consuming us. Yes, I'm exaggerating, but seriously, talk to us. Still on Bigfoot? Take a look at that. Looks like a Bigfoot, does it not? This image was apparently captured by a trail camera set up in the woods, and the uploader of the image believes he hit the paranormal motherlode. He believes he has finally captured the highest resolution of Bigfoot images to ever be caught on a trail camera. Taking a look at that image, we don't dispute that that looks like the back of a primate that's capable of standing on its two feet. It actually reminds me of the old Kong movies. Although the picture is very detailed with the creature's fur at Al, when you take a closer look at the edge of its fur that ties into the main image, it's unnaturally blurry, especially on the left side of its body. This makes me doubt the authenticity of the image, and I suspect that it might have been created using AI, but perhaps that's just me. What do you think? For our next clip, we travel back in time to 1994 for footage not many have seen. Take a look. If the enigmatic lady gave you shivers, what follows might just send you tumbling into a whirlwind of spine-tingling disbelief. Brace yourselves, for the stage is now set for a nightmarish performance captured by the ever-watchful lens of a trail cam. A creature not of this world or realm emerges from the shadows, a colossal figure, wolf-like in form, but oh so much more. Glowing eyes pierce through the darkness, their radiance reminiscent of moonlight. This entity, this aberration that defies the very fabric of logic, boasts muscles that would make even Schwarzenegger raise an eyebrow. Imagine a wolf sculpted by the hands of a bodybuilder, a creature whose brawn could wrestle with the very essence of fear itself. As if that was not enough, it has a face that strikes terror into the hearts of the stoutest souls. Although we may never experience its bite, it has teeth that appear to be as sharp as a guillotine's blade, and for some odd reason it has eyes locked onto the camera with great yet fearful intensity. That's certainly no ordinary wolf. I mean, its features look like a splice between human and wolf DNA. The proportions are all wrong. This creature stands defiantly on the outskirts of normalcy, its very size a challenge to reality itself. If you love the paranormal, identifying this shouldn't be too hard. It's definitely a werewolf. But is this image real, though? If there truly is a creature out there that looks like this, well, I'd love to hear your thoughts on it. What do you think? Yep, that's a man in the woods alone with a Bigfoot. The exact location is near Deduct Spring in the Blue Mountain Range in Oregon. You can tell from his heavy breathing that the man's very anxious and perhaps even scared. His shaky hands make it hard to tell what he's scared of, but a few seconds into the footage and it becomes apparent. There's a giant a few meters away from him with a human-like gait, yet having an ape-like body. Its arms are unusually large and it walks as though it was very heavy. It looks like it could really cause some damage to the man if it wanted to, which explains his heavy breathing, but for some odd reason the creature isn't interested in him. The man recording the footage believes it's a Bigfoot, and I'm tempted to say I do believe him. I mean, how else do we explain what we're seeing here? Bear in mind that this is 1994 and CGI and special effects were not as popular as they are today. Unless, of course, that's a man in a suit. 
but that's least likely if you ask me. What do you think, though? Footage from a biker exploring the woods. Two weird things happen in the footage. Have a look. At first glance, the biker seems to be enjoying himself, and the footage appears perfectly ordinary, until he mentions the broken log and his shin. I that log, man. Did you see how that log's broken in half? My shin broke it in half. At that point, it's clear that something went awry. Luckily, he's still riding the bike and seems unharmed. A closer look at the footage, however, and we spot a funny-looking creature in the background. The alien-looking creature doesn't look like anything you'd see or expect to find in the wild, but there it is. Also, in the first few seconds of the video, we hear a certain sound. That log, man. Did you see how that log's broken in half? My shin broke it in half. Did you catch that? It sounds alien, almost reminiscent of the creature we spotted near the end of the footage. Could this be a genuine encounter? Is this our first contact with an extraterrestrial visitor? Did an alien spacecraft quietly touch down in the woods, only to be unexpectedly interrupted by the biker? And here's the kicker. Can we even trust the authenticity of the footage? Numerous questions, yet no answers. What do you think is happening here? Share your thoughts in the comment section. Next, we have a trail cam capture of a creature that looks like a grasshopper, but it's the size of a man. Did you see it? In the first capture, we see its face, and in the second, we see the rest of its body. My team and I almost discarded the footage because we thought it was a regular grasshopper caught on a trail camera. After a second look, and we realized that the creature was actually the size of a man. I mean, take a look at the trees in the background. Do you see its size correlation with the creature? It's definitely the size of a man, if not bigger. We cross-checked our database of paranormal and otherworldly creatures and couldn't find anything remotely like this creature. Could it be a new creature that's yet to be documented, or are we simply looking at a computer-generated image? Share your thoughts with us. Speaking of creatures we have a hard time identifying, a subscriber of the channel sent this capture in. He believes it's a paranormal creature haunting his property. We've critically looked at the image for several days and can't seem to make out what it really is. A team member says he believes we're looking at a hog, but I personally don't see anything of interest or worry in the capture. Do you? Next, we have this trail cam footage that's had us scratching our heads. What do you see in the footage? It starts off looking like your everyday trail cam capture. A nice capture of a raccoon going about its business in the evening, but look up. Do you see it? Right in the top corner of the footage, there are a set of lights moving in a way that makes me believe they're from the same aircraft. But no human aircraft have lights arranged like that unless I'm unaware, which I highly doubt. To add to that, there are no flight paths where this footage was taken. What could we be dealing with then? Well, the answer is simple, a potential spacecraft. Just a few weeks ago, my claims might have seemed far-fetched, but considering that certain well-known government entities are now monitoring spacecrafts, I don't think I'm too far off the mark. Seriously though, what do you think that thing in the footage is? Tell us in the comments section. Next, we have this odd-looking capture from a trail cam located deep in the woods. Did you see it? Does it look like a normal capture you'd expect from a trail cam? It's certainly not. The owner of the trail cam was surprised that the image came out like this on his trail cam since he'd not added any effects to the image and the device itself was not faulty in any way and captured high-definition images. A closer look at the tape and you'll realize that it looks like a bear or some other type of canine. But bears don't turn camera images white. 
What then could be going on in the image? Are we dealing with a being from another dimension? Could it be an alien that ran some interference with the camera to delete footage it may have captured of itself, or is the uploader of the image simply lying? Share your thoughts with us in the comments section, we'd love to hear them. If you have followed and been on this channel for long, you know we only love to post trail cam captures, but this next one has us so spooked that we just had to show it to you. Have a look. The video starts with what looks like a couple of friends enjoying a drive. This atmosphere is, however, interrupted when they realize that there is something chasing them, which is weird because they're on a highway. Glancing behind, they spot a figure, or perhaps a humanoid-like creature, in pursuit. In a matter of seconds, the creature closes in, prompting them to accelerate. But how could it catch up so quickly? Who or what is this? Even Usain Bolt might struggle to match such speed. Upon closer examination, we notice the creature's white or pale skin and distinctly human-like features. Yet, the extraordinary speed and appearance defy any human explanation. Our thoughts turn to the possibility of a cryptid, perhaps even the infamous rake. But can a rake move with such speed? Well, that remains a mystery, but what do you guys think? Do you see that? Can you see how the creature stares directly and eerily at the camera? It's almost as though it knew it was being watched and wanted to let whoever on the camera to be aware of this fact. But you have got to wonder, is that really a gorilla or are we dealing with a cryptid like a Bigfoot? Don't get me wrong, but when you take a closer look at the image, you'll realize that whatever it is, it's walking on its two feet, not necessarily on its knuckles like a gorilla would. I don't know about you, but if I owned this trail camera, I'd watch my back or avoid that part of the woods altogether. There is something about mountain hiking and paranormal sightings. People who go to the highlands always seem to have a tale to tell, especially on the Appalachian Trail. This footage was uploaded onto the internet and it remains a mystery to date. A hiker went to the Appalachian Trail when he came across this strange creature. The creature looked like some kind of a bird, but was bigger. It had white feathers and a large beak. However, its eyes were big and hollow. The creature stood hidden behind a tree, so it's hard to make out the rest of its features. The internet became a canvas for the world to ponder, a virtual gallery for the enigma captured on film. Yet alas, despite the collective brain power of the internet's denizens, the creature remains nameless, its identity as elusive as the morning mist. The realm of possibility widens. Is this an undiscovered species, an interdimensional visitor, or a resident of the paranormal's menagerie? What do you think? Next, we have footage we haven't had in a while on this channel, and by that, I mean footage of a child lost in the forest. Take a look. As you can see, there's a young child roaming the forest at night. The uploader of the footage insists that there are no settlements in this part of the wood where the camera that captured this was located. Due to this fact, he finds it hard to believe this footage exists and thinks we're dealing with a ghost or spirit. But are we now? It's hard to say, but I'm having one of those hunches that this footage isn't real. Although there's not much to go within the footage, if this image was captured in the woods, there should definitely be more foliage than we're seeing in the capture. Don't get me wrong, but it looks like this was captured in the city or at least a developed area. I suspect that the pole to the boy's right might not necessarily be a tree or a shrub, but possibly a utility pole in a residential area. A part of me just feels like someone is looking for their five minutes of fame. But what do you think? Behold the spectacle that beckons us into the heart of the woods. A sight that prompts us to question our senses. Is that a tree sprouting horns? But hold your breath, dear observers, for truth often dances on the fine line between the extraordinary and the everyday. While our minds may be inclined to plunge into the depths of the paranormal, this tale hails from a different realm, 
one where the spirits of tradition and ritual intertwine with the roots of the Earth itself. As people of the paranormal community are tempted to believe this is a tree growing horns, fear not, dear enthusiasts of the unexplained, for the answer for this enigma lies within the annals of human history. There is an ancient ritual where the natives of the land back then put the slaughtered heads of rams into the trunk of the tree. With time as their muse, they fused with the very fibers of the tree, becoming one with its essence, an immortal testament to the connection between the tangible and the mystical. That's what's happening here, at least we think so. If you believe it's mystical, however, we won't take that from you. Next, we have another trail cam footage taken from a remote woodland area. We've no idea what we're looking at. Perhaps you could help. Did you see it? Watch again. You see it, don't you? There's quick movement from the right side of the frame to the left. The camera's position is quite the distance from the moving object, but whatever it is, it's quite fast. We attempted zooming in to perhaps discover what the moving object is, and this is what we saw. You see it too, don't you? There's no being in it. It just looks like moving fog and smoke, but how's that even possible, especially at that speed? Could it be a paranormal creature? Could it be the result of zooming in the low-quality image? Or could the footage be edited? Share your thoughts with us. We'd love to hear it. Ah, the stage is set for a spine-tingling tale from the depths of the unknown. In this footage, we have a crew of brave sewage workers descending into the underbelly of an abandoned sewer in Liverpool, but guess what they encounter on their way down? As the intrepid explorers ventured deep into the subterranean labyrinth, a flicker of movement in the shadows caught their attention. A mysterious figure, an enigmatic intruder lurking in the darkness. Did I say intruder? It looked like it was pretty much at home. Perhaps the sewage workers were the ones invading its home and had to make sure it was safe. Either way, eager to capture this unearthly encounter, they whipped out their trusty recording device, turning the scene into a reel straight out of a found footage thriller. And there, in the obsidian abyss, behold the unexpected, a pair of luminous eyes akin to stars glimpsing through the fabric of the cosmos. As soon as the eyes noticed they were being filmed or watched, they retreated. Within seconds, however, those glowing eyes return, accompanied by a spectral arm reaching out from the darkness, its fingers tracing the very walls as if they held secrets untold. Alas, the jig was up. The creature had been caught in the spotlight, and in a flash it scurried away like a character fleeing the scene of a crime. What manner of being is this, you ask? A creature straddling the line between the human and the monstrous, its arms hinting at a humanoid form, while its radiant eyes evoke the eerie allure of the unknown. There is only one creature that fits this description. The Rake. What do you think? Next, we have this rare footage from the wild. I mean, just have a look. That's a mama moose and its baby calf. If you know anything about the wild, you know night times are such dangerous times and danger soon arrives from the right part of the frame. It moves quickly and goes after the calf. Mama Moose notices the shift in the atmosphere and went into a defensive stance, but even that was not enough to protect her young one. In an attempt to knock out the predator, she knocks out her young and the wolves try to capitalize on it. She doesn't give up, however, and stands over her calf, kicking frantically. I can imagine what fear it felt knowing how helpless they were. As much as I'd love to tell you that they overcame and escaped the wolves, the truth is we don't know if they did. The whole thing ended off of camera, but knowing how relentless and persistent wolves can be, I don't think it ended well. In this episode, we bring back our bonus footage section. Can you guess what this beautiful creature is? It looks beautiful, doesn't it? But what creature is it? What species? Do you know any facts about them? If you do, tell us in the comments section. Start with bonus footage so we easily identify it. The most accurate description with the rarest fact will win a feature in our next video. All the best.
Some have suggested it could be a bear, but others in the paranormal community believe that we're actually dealing with a Bigfoot here. If you ask me, however, I have reservations. First of all, the creature's eyes are beady and small, which makes me doubt it's a Bigfoot. Secondly, I don't think this footage looks like the ones taken by trail cameras unless it's a normal camera. But if it is, how did their hands not shake while they recorded and why didn't the creature take off? So many unanswered questions and red flags. Forgive me for playing the devil's advocate, but what do you think? Do you think the footage is real or do you have reservations too? Tell us in the comments section. If you've been a faithful follower of our chronicles, you're well aware that venturing alone into the depths of the woods is a recipe for hair-raising adventures that you won't find in any travel brochure. Watch this video. The footage was captured by a lone hiker innocently embracing the serenity of nature's embrace, unaware of the chilling plot twist about to unfold. As he meanders through the leafy labyrinth, a peculiar sensation tingles down his spine a subtle whisper of unease that only Mother Nature can master. He turned around only to spot this strange woman standing by a tree. Frozen in time, this spectral maiden gazes upon the world with a lifeless demeanor. But here's where things go from eerie to downright bone-chilling. Rivulets of a crimson-like liquid trickle down her face like a nightmarish raindrop painting her existence with an otherworldly palette. Was she a mere illusion, a puppetry of light and shadow, or did the woods conceal something far more sinister? A ritual gone awry, an ancient curse brought to life in this isolated clearing? Could it be a fallen soul trapped between realms or a mirage concocted by the forest's twisted imagination? Or could it simply be a setup and a hoax? It's hard to say, but what do you think? Next, we have this footage that was sent to us from another subscriber. He was very sure that his trail camera had captured a skinwalker, but instead of talking about it, perhaps I should let you see it. It's not always that you see a deer stand on its hind legs. Seeing the deer stand on its hind legs right in front of the camera made the individual who sent it in think it was a skinwalker playing with him. Based on my little knowledge of deer, however, I know that that's definitely not a skinwalker. Deer can stand on their hind legs when they need to reach food from higher heights, which is what I think is going on here. But I could be wrong. Of all the things a skinwalker could do in front of a trail camera, why would it stand on its hind legs? But those are just my thoughts. What do you think? Now let's turn our gaze to the majestic and quiet character, the Bull Elk, a fellow who's got a peculiar way of preparing for the grand dance of romance. Look at this gentle giant adorned with an impressive crown of antlers, ready to woo the cow elks with a performance that can only be described as uh, unconventional. Behold the spectacle known as wallowing, a practice that might seem to human eyes as if our dashing bull is getting a little too cozy with the mud. But lo and behold, there's more to this than meets the eye. The bull elk, with an air of determination worthy of a rom-com hero, plunges his antlers into the soft embraces of the earth as if he's a maestro conducting an opera of attraction. But let's not be too hasty in judgment, for in the animal kingdom, the concept of charm takes on unique forms, much like the varying genres of our favorite films. While we humans dress to the nines and dab on fragrances to woo potential partners, the animal realm takes a different route. Our dapper bull, it seems, has traded in designer suits for a mud bath, a perfume of his own making, a distinctive aroma of earthiness mingled with, well, his brand. You see, the bull elk takes the art of seduction to a whole new level. Covered in a concoction of mud and, yes, his urine, he struts his stuff in an attempt to turn the heads, or should I say hooves, of the cow elks. They sometimes do this for health reasons too, but I'm betting this guy is doing it for romance. He looks like a true lover boy channeling his inner Casanova through earthly extravagance. What do you think? For our next footage, we visit the Tejon Ranch in California. It's remarkable footage, isn't it? 
It's not every day you get to see a ferocious predator like the bear hunt in its full glory. See the speed and power. The piglet had no chance, and I won't be surprised if its parents fled for their lives as well. Knowing Boris, however, that will be a rare occurrence as they'd fight to the death for their young. Either way, it's a sad end for the piglet, but that's the circle of life, I guess. Speaking of wild predators, take a look at this majestic and beautiful wild cat. Do you know what species of cat it is? Do you have an idea of what it's doing in the footage? Tell us in the comments section and add one rare fact about the creature. Start your comment with bonus footage so we easily identify it. The most accurate description with the rarest fact will win a feature in our next video. All the best. As we do with all our episodes, we sign off today's video in style. You know what? Instead of just talking, allow me to show you. These bats sure know how to hang out in style. Just take a look at their unique antics. It may seem like they're hitting the dance floor with some impressive moves, but the truth is they're just doing their bat thing. And when you turn the camera upside down, it creates this illusion of them dancing on the ceiling. Nature always has a way of surprising us with its quirks, and this display of bats hanging from a mesh, even though it's not a dance-off, is a testament to the wonders of the animal kingdom. It just goes to show that there's always something fascinating happening, even when we least expect it. And with that, we conclude today's episode. Thank you for staying throughout. If you have any trail cam footage you'd like the rest of the world to see, please send it over to us at classifiedcaptures at gmail.com. Don't be shy and don't think it's crazy. We'll help you make sense of even the most bizarre of captures. What's more, we'll give you the credit unless you want to remain anonymous. What are you waiting for? Send it in. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe as it helps us out a ton. See you in the next one.